Omaha's 2017 mayoral race, the two candidates spent a combined $3.8 million, yet only a little over a third of the registered voters went to the polls, and that was above average. What we are seeing pretty consistently is voter turnout in off-year elections is extremely low. The legislature's Government and Military Affairs Committee is studying whether to require all local governments to hold its regular elections in line with either presidential elections where there's 70 percent turnout or a gubernatorial race where 45 percent of the voters go to the polls. Omaha community leader Preston Love likes the idea. The bottom line is the bottom line, which is if you bring out more people for whatever reason, then they're going to vote more heavily. According to Douglas County's election commissioner, combining the ballots could save taxpayers in the metro a half million dollars every four years. There hasn't been a hue and cry from the public, number one. But City Council two. President Ben oh, Gray says got, both the council the and mayor opposed the idea. A committee that reviewed the city charter in 2011 rejected any change, saying it would cause a disruption in the current terms of the mayor and council and would take away local control. Placing that change upon us rather than us making that change ourselves. Lincoln also holds off-year city elections. Officials worry consolidating the ballot would drive up campaign costs and local issues would get lost in state and national battles. And we're not certain that people's feelings about Donald Trump or Hillary Clinton should really impact their vote on local candidates running for office. In Lincoln, Andrew Ozaki, KETV, News Watch 7.